Hello everyone. Thank you for your interest in our handheld beveling tools. This video will show you how our most popular pneumatic tool, the SMA40P, is being used and handled to apply all sorts of bevels along the edges of steel plates and pipes. It's really simple. It works just like a wood router, only that here we are dealing with steel rather than wood. Here is the milling head, with four inserts mounted onto it. In the center, you see the guide wheel that pilots the tool along the edge of your workpiece. The nice thing about it is that it prevents you from gouging into the material. It assures a very uniform and smooth bevel. However, keep in mind that it does indeed copy the surface it rolls off on. So if you have a rough surface, your beveled surface will also reflect it. Use the guide plate to keep the tool level and to avoid any wobble. The guide plate also takes the weight off the operator and makes working with the SMA40P much less strenuous. Position the tool so that the milling head is initially not in contact with the edge. Keep in mind that due to the rotation of the milling head, you can move the beveler only from left to right or clockwise along curved edges. Now you can turn the machine on by squeezing the trigger. Move slowly straight forward into the material. Once you feel that the guide wheel has made contact with the land, you can start following the contour. Apply a steady pressure onto the machine by pushing it against the edge and slightly forward. Feel free to use your body weight to help you. Now follow the edge in a steady continuous motion and the tool does the work for you. Don't forget to walk along with the tool and don't overextend your arms or you'll lose control. As a novice, start off with a shallow cut to get a feel for the machine. The bevel depth is set by twisting the guide plate up or down and thereby exposing the inserts more or less. Once you get comfortable with the machine, feel free to be more daring and to run wider bevels in one pass. The bevel width depends a lot on the material grade. Obviously, it is easier to bevel, let's say, aluminum than stainless steel. However, the SMA40P is capable of beveling even armored plate. Changing the inserts is easy. Just loosen the screws and flip the insert around. Every insert has four sides. The standard M-type insert is 11 millimeters long. Should you need a wider bevel, you can put two of the inserts in the outer position on the milling head so that your resulting maximum bevel width is up to 5 eighths of an inch. Also available are 22 millimeter long inserts. To change the angle, you have to change the milling head. It's really easy. Lock the drive with this locking pin. Take the five millimeter hex wrench that is provided with the machine and twist off the guide wheel. Once it's off, loosen the milling head with the same wrench. You'll notice that it's pressed out slightly so that you can pull it out easily. If it's stuck, Twist in the guide wheel one or two turns and use it to pull out the milling head. See the hex-shaped underside of the milling head? It sinks into the corresponding recess to transfer the torque. Now reverse this sequence with a new milling head with a different angle. The standard angles are 30, 45, and 60 degrees, but there are many more available and we can even make custom sizes if required. Once the guide wheel is tight again, pull out the locking pin. One unique feature of our handheld beveling tools is their capability to apply rounded edges by using special rounded inserts. This, for example, is our 3 mm or 1 8 inch radius insert. It even comes with 8 usable edges per insert, mounted onto the standard 45 degree milling head. It takes a bit of tweaking to get the guide plate in the exact position, but once it's set right, lock it down and it applies smooth, rounded edges. Larger radii are also available. Besides 3mm and 2mm, we have 4mm, 6mm or 1 quarter inch, 8mm and 10mm radii. This is a wonderful feature when you need to paint or coat your workpiece later on. 
Paint is much less susceptible to chipping on rounded edges than on sharp edges. All you shipbuilders, bridge builders, and anybody else who has to coat and paint, you'll love this. Imagine having to grind such a smooth and uniform edge. You can apply our handheld bevelers along straight edges, curved contours, holes, or use it to apply countersinks. Look how quickly and easily it's applying this countersink. Insert the milling head, keep it initially off the edge, turn on the machine, move gently into the material, and finally complete the cycle by applying pressure against the contour. Can't beat that, can you? Besides the pneumatic SMA40P machine that this video has focused on, we also have its smaller brother, the SMA20P, and the larger model, the SMA60P, as well as three electrical machines, the SMA30, SMA40, and SMA50. Please download our data sheets for additional information or give us a call at 859-331-8770 or send us an email at contact at shmusa.com.